That's why, Ashley, I did ask Sheriff Leon Lott those questions, and he ended up saying that both of these shootings are indeed connected from the one this morning and the, from the one back in late March, but he did not comment on whether this was gang affiliated. Now, Lott believes that the suspects in these shootings are more than likely teenagers. He vowed that the ones responsible will go to jail. I went to the Falls neighborhood myself earlier today and residents were highly upset and vocal about the safety of the neighborhood. Now in the last hour, Sheriff Lott said that cameras would be installed in the neighborhood and it will take a couple of weeks for them to put those in place throughout the falls. However, residents were very vocal on who should be held accountable for these shootings. I asked Sheriff Lott, how do we solve the problem of these teens having guns? And here's what he has to say. Got to hold those that are accountable that um, are going out here with these guns and, and doing this shooting. They need to be held accountable. Everybody says, oh my God, they're poor little kids. They're 14, 15, 16 years old. They kill somebody, that person's still dead. It doesn't matter if they're killed by a 14-year-old, if they're killed by a 44-year-old. You know, they, they need to be held accountable. Now, Lot emphasized that teens with guns is the number one priority for the department, and he says that the criminal justice system needs to hold the suspects more accountable. Reporting in Richland County, Jalen Tart, WIS News 10.